Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how you can upgrade the hard drive that's in your MacBook Pro. Here I've got the 13 inch MacBook Pro but it's basically the same instructions for any of them. I'm going to be upgrading from a 250 gig to a um, 500 gig Samsung drive. You're going to need two screwdrivers, they're the Philips OO and the Torx 6 screwdrivers and just use your Phillips screwdriver to unscrew all the screws on the bottom of your MacBook Pro. Once they are all out you should be able to just pop off the uh, bottom of the laptop and then you can see everything that's inside. Don't worry about uh, replacing your hard drive, it won't void your warranty as long as you don't mess anything else up. Uh, there's just a one piece of plastic that's holding the hard drive down so I just remove the two screws on that which you can see there. Once that's done it should just pop out. As you can see there. Then just lift on the plastic little tab on it and remove the hard drive. There's just one little connector on the side of it that's uh, that needs to be removed. And remove the tab also because you need to put that into your new hard drive. Then just use your T6 screwdriver and remove the four little pegs from the side. Once that's done you can get your new hard drive out you need to put all them pegs back in so it'll be held into the laptop properly. Once that's done you just need to put the SATA connector back on so you just line that up and push it on like that. Then I almost forgot but you need to put on the plastic tab that you took off the old one. So then if you need to replace this one in, f in the future then you can easily get it out. So just uh, let that drop down. And then just secure it with the piece of plastic. Okay and that's it. All you need to do now is put your cover back on, screw all the screws in. Make sure you get the right ones in the right place. Then you'll need to put your operating system back onto the laptop, onto the new hard drive. So you can just do that with your, like your Snow Leopard installed DVD. Okay, thanks for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to my YouTube channel just by clicking on the subscribe button. And uh, also like and comment on this video if you found it useful.